Yo yo people, Garrett to doing here for another video and in this video we are going to be going camping but as you guys can tell we are not alone, not by any means. There are so many people in the server, I believe there's around 4 or 5, maybe even 6. So here's what we're going to be driving today, obviously it is an XLT, it's very very cool, it's a 2020 and we got our camp it attachment right on the back so we can sleep the night but I might end up going and crashing in one of the guys tents just because it gives a little bit of a better experience in my opinion and then obviously we have our Can-Am on the back this will be able to rip through some fields I'm looking forward to it alright guys it's good to see everybody here did everybody have a good drive down no crashes oh yeah nice smooth oh, yeah. drive lots of mud though I think we're gonna have a little more mud uh, turn around guys there's there's oh, the trailhead it's looking a little rough. The the loggers kind of gave up going through here. So I'm thinking we should probably unload trailers and take you guys' ATVs. I have a truck that can make it through. I don't know if you guys can. So. Wait, wait okay. Yeah. You're saying your truck's going to do this no problem? My truck will. Did you see it? Um, oh. I saw it. You think just because you have nice tires that you're going to be able to get That's better than this? all your guys' ATVs combined. Razor, I won't. Okay, no Spencer. We'll, we'll, we'll see what happens. Okay, so what I'm thinking, let's unload. Let's get ATVs, razors out there, bring your chainsaws, and then we are going to kind of find a spot, make it, and then hopefully uh, hopefully we can bring the trailers in. Obviously, first things first, we've got to lower down the back of our trailer. Let's now start up our Can-Am. This thing sounds very, very nice. I'm actually kind of surprised. I didn't expect this to have such a nice engine tune. But we'll go nice and slowly off of here. We are slightly wide for this trailer's dimensions, but obviously our suspension can do it with no problem at all. <laughs> Let's try to not hit the trailer behind us and drive right to the pass entrance. I think this should be a pretty good staging area. We can shut off our engine just for now. Spencer, is he really trying to take this thing through here? Yeah, if my truck can't make it through, there's no way in heck this can. CJ, why can't you just like do what everyone else is doing and just go camping? Because those things are just too uncomfortable. I need this, comfort. Here we oh, go. Come on. All nice right. and easy guys don't go too fast everyone keep an eye on who's in front of you just in case you see anyone uh, better pop a tire or something you know okay it's not too bad the logs almost help yeah it kind of gives you a little bit of grip but if you hit it at the wrong angle it can do the opposite here we go look at that suspension we have pretty big pretty big water spot up ahead oh my goodness all right keep coming garrett keep coming keep coming i'm going i'm going should i just take it head get ready, on get some speed yep get okay some here speed, we go man. ready Go, go, go. You got like racing slicks on that thing. Oh, yeah. It, it, this can do anything. Okay. Oh, this is so much fun to drive. I don't know why we've never used this Can-Am before. Oh, okay, wait. I am starting to get a little stuck. Keep on going. Be very, very careful. Look at that. What a beautiful scene. Oh, I'm stuck in, I'm stuck in the puddle back here. Oh, geez. Okay. Uh, it's, not that, it's not that bad. Let's think. Ooh. Okay, he's going to hung oh, up on this deep. log, guys. Oh, Garrett. It's deep. It's oh. deep. Um, Here, get out, get out, I'm get out, out, I'm out, I'm out. It's coming up. My engine's still okay, on. Good. What do I do? I turn off, Let's, turn off. Uh, it okay. should shut off. <laughs> if it doesn't shut off, that's a pretty good engine. Yeah, just shut it off. Okay, okay. I think Everybody it's jump off. out. It's too deep. C CJ, don't do it, man. Oh, I'll be fine. Look, I'll just oh, give him a little tap Oh, CJ. Here. Bad you know idea. What? You know what? Actually, do. Do. Give him a tap. There, there you go. go. Garrett is sunken in. CJ, if you actually want to come behind him, see if you can tap him. Nobody else come through, though. We don't want more people getting stuck. Okay, you got this. It's still running. It's still running. It's kind of spurting water. No way. Give her a love tap. Go, go, go. Here we go. I'm onto some logs. <laughs> yes. Good job, Spencer. Thank you. Okay, right. pull, uh, pull fuel filters, air filters. Let's kind of start draining this thing out. Yeah. I got some bad news here. Oh, no. Hey, CJ, you know, like, this isn't the boat dealership, right? Because um, you, you look like a boat right now. I do, don't I? All right, I'm gonna yell go, and then and then you and then just go, and hopefully, if we yell to stop, make sure you stop. Somebody put a coat on top of the cable just in case it breaks. Okay, that's a safety practice so it doesn't like slingshot. But CJ, you ready? Yep. All right, here we go. Go, 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 go. Push. Oh, oh, oh close, close, close. There you go. Okay, so we're gonna be trying to drive a lot more careful this time since we already got sunken once this thing is still running though i'm just gonna kind of follow the same path that all the other guys are taking hopefully if all of them make it through that means that i'll be able to somebody stuck up there no uh, i need a little love tap the love tap. i got you i got you i got you all right everybody just keep your momentum up do not stop you're gonna get stuck 
Holy biscuits. We got some big trees to chop down. All right, guys. I got to shut off these headlights. There we go. And let's see. Is this thing still on? Nope. I think someone else is, is still running. I'm not quite sure which one. Whatever. It's not mine. Doesn't really matter. Now, we do got our trusty chainsaw, though. So we will be chopping down some of these trees. Here we go. Nice, big base cut right at the bottom. Go. Three, two, one. Who just dropped a tree on my head? I don't know how I survived that, but that was not the cut I was hoping for. Okay, you know what? Before Spencer sees this, I'm going to cut down a little bit lower just so it looks like we did a slightly better job. We'll just kind of chuck it that way. Oh, yeah. Super strength. Uh, Garrett, there might uh, be a little dent in your um, canine. What, what oh do you mean God. a little? Whoa. Whoa. Okay, who who did this? Uh, me. Uh, I'm you, sorry. You, okay, I'm glad you're taking responsibility here, but seriously, have you never cut down a tree before? It's okay, and I should be fine. There's a tree on top of my vehicle. Okay, guys, I'm going to try starting this thing up. I don't know if it's going to work. Oh, bad start, bad start. Oh. Okay, we're moving, we're moving. This is good, this is good. Just try to keep on going. I have no clue what path they took. You know what? We're just gonna have to make our own. Don't stop, don't stop. As long as we keep up this momentum, we should be able to get through any kind of deep water. Okay, I am so lost over here. No clue where we are going. I'm just gonna keep trying to just find the exit or wherever the water starts to get a little bit more shallow. We are definitely in some kind of familiar terrain. Oh yeah, that's definitely the puddle we got stuck in. I decided to go and try it on the other side this time. Seems to have worked a little bit better. But now we just gotta continue down the path. It should be pretty much smooth sailing from here. Okay, we are finally at the exit here. Wow, they are already loaded up and ready to go on through. Just kind of drive on to here, nice and slow. Here we go. Perfect. I like it. All right, boys, stay on the radio. If anybody gets stuck, let me know. I think everybody's getting stuck besides me but and CJ. So. It looks like we have four people in front of us and then one cruising right behind, not too far. But I definitely would like to be a bit closer up since everyone's bringing their full loads and trailers. It's, it's just going to be a very messy drive. You know what? I'm hopping up on my roof. I want to see what's going on. There we are. Okay, so we have someone behind us who's struggling. We have many people in front of us struggling. Oh, wait, wait. Are they going? Yeah, they are. Perfect. Great timing. Here we go. It's our turn to trek on through. Hopefully, we don't get stuck. Spencer is watching. Let's give him a little honk of the horn. There we go. <laughs> so for whatever reason, there are two people that are right beside each other. Not quite sure what is happening here. Oh, okay. So what's happening is that CJ decided to be the best man ever and push the other vehicle through. I guess they did get caught up on something there. Oh, geez. I don't like stopping in the water. You know what? I'm saying goodbye to the convoy and just going to try squeezing on by all of these guys. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. They are so stuck. They have no clue how to get on through. I'm just gonna try squeezing on in. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. All right, guys, we got the campsite set up. I think we're good to go. Oh, yeah, it's looking really, really nice here. I love how you did up the place. Yeah, no, I just kind of threw it up, you know. Um, looks like somebody put a tent out in the swamp, so I don't know who's staying out there. But this is a six-person tent. Yeah, we should be good. I brought a bunch of food. We're gonna, go it, it comes with, look at this grill. This actually works as a grill, oh my so. God. Let's uh, maybe cut up some more firewood and bring it in. We should be good to go. I actually have a grill. Look at that. Even better. I, I'm exhausted. All that mudding, it really took a toll on me. I'm pretty beat too. Let's, uh, uh, yeah, I'm going to take a nap and then we can have dinner here in a few hours. All right. Sounds good, man. See you then. Ugh, good morning, guys. Well, okay. It's, I guess night, but let's see what everyone's up to. It seems like everyone's now awake. Some steaks. We'll throw them up on the grill. Okay, so it seems like Spencer's going to be cooking up a bunch of steaks. I'm going to, of course, get mine cooked medium. I don't know what your guys' preference is, but that is always my go-to, just in case, you know, sometimes they undercook, sometimes they overcook. Now, I don't know why Spencer thinks he's able to come to my cribs over here. Th this is my area. What, what is he up to? <laughs> But yeah, guys, so that's going to be it for this video. If you guys did enjoy it, please drop a like. I'd greatly appreciate it. And consider subscribing. 
You guys are awesome. Bye-bye.